trust is really the most important commodity of all. So many more things could be happening or you could be doing so much better. But what's holding us back is this issue of trust between public and private sector. Often, in fact, they're pitched against each other in an adversarial posturing. You have to invest a lot of time in building trust before you can actually begin to action anything meaningful in the partnership. And that's when you can actually begin to do meaningful, large-scale, impactful work together. The second leadership lesson really for me is um, related to genuinely caring about what you do. People really don't care how much you know until they know how much you care which links to the issue of trust. A lot of the crises we're seeing in the world is related to this, this phenomenon where, in essence, to too many people, it's just a job, or I am just playing my little part, and I don't connect my part to all the other dots that it needs to connect to in order for, us to, for it to be meaningful. My third lesson is that failure is actually a good thing. As I've matured in my leadership journey, that has become a very important ingredient, is to embrace the failures. What those failures taught me was that I actually had not been learning enough before, and I'd become too comfortable. You know, I wasn't really actually growing as a person. So if I'm hiring somebody in my company right now and they cannot tell me of instances where they've truly failed, whether it's on a, in their personal life or in their professional life, I really will not hire that person because with failure comes so much growth.